YouTube just announced a brand new feature that's gonna help you and me as content creators here on the platform to make more money here on YouTube. And how are they gonna do this? Well, they're gonna help you sell merch in a super powerful way because the merchandise is actually gonna show up right under your video. So in this video, we're gonna cover everything that you wanna know about the new YouTube merchandise shelf. I'm gonna go give you all the details, the requirements, the setup, everything, and even my thoughts. Let's do this. DarylEves.com Hello, my people of the internet, Daryl Eves here. Now, if you are new to me and this channel, we talk about everything YouTube. We talk about strategies, we talk about tactics, we talk about audience development, how to get more views, to get more subscribers, and ultimately making more money. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell notification so you don't miss out. Merchandise isn't a new concept for content creators here on YouTube. In fact, YouTube content creators have been pushing and peddling their merch for a very long time. So some great news for content creators that really wanna use merch. I was at VidCon listening to the chief product officer, that's the CPO, <laughs> and he was introducing a new way, a powerful way to display your merchandise right under your video. That's right, now content creators here on YouTube are able to sell their merchandise, their t-shirts, their phone cases, their pillows, their socks, and even leggings. Leggings? <laughs> now let's go ahead and I'm gonna show you how to set up the merch shelf for yourself. And I'll also talk about the requirements and kind of my thoughts uh, a little bit later in this video. Now to set this up, all you need to do is go over to the new YouTube Studio Beta like this. And what you need to do is mouse on over to the monetization section, click on that and mouse over to merchandise. And see this little link here, it says see more? Let's go ahead and click that. Now the next thing that we need to do is make sure that we have a Teespring account. Now if you don't have a Teespring account, you can go ahead and click on the link in the description below. And what we're gonna do once it's set up is we're gonna actually link your Teespring account to your YouTube channel. And how to do that is basically click get the Teespring ID uh, and it will open up a new tab on Teespring. It'll show you a nine digit number, and that's your store ID. All you gotta do is copy that. We're gonna go ahead and paste that nine digit store ID into the Creator Studio and go ahead and hit connect. Now the next thing that you need to do is design some products on Teespring. Now I already did that and all you gotta do, once the designs are complete, you actually have products on your store, you go ahead and hit the complete button. Now there's one last thing, YouTube has some guidelines that your merch doesn't promote hate and violence and it fully complies with the YouTube community guidelines that consistently change. So you make sure that you hit that community guidelines. I put a link in the description below so you know exactly what you're able to do and what you're not able to do. Now, a special note, don't freak out if you're not seeing products immediately, because it's gonna take one to three days for that product to actually start showing up underneath your videos. So here is something interesting that's happening, especially with this uh, beta program that I'm actually kind of shocked by. Now, now, YouTube is actually going to give a referral fee. That's right, a referral fee for anyone that's going from YouTube to Teespring to purchase your products. They're gonna give you as a content creator $1. <laughs> so if you bring a million people in, that's a million dollars that YouTube's gonna give you. Now that's pretty big uh, because you know normally they'd take like 30 or 40%. So I think this is huge. Now th this promotion for giving you a dollar is only gonna last for one year. Now here are some of the requirements and I know some of you will be bummed out, but you need to be a little patient because YouTube, this is their standard way of releasing a beta product. Uh, first off, you need to live in the United States. Second, you need to have at least 10,000 subscribers subscribers and be in the YouTube partner program. And you cannot have any copyright strikes or any community strikes. Now the teams at YouTube, everyone that's working there, I believe that this is a great start and I think it's a great partnership with Teespring. Now I've been a customer for Teespring for a very long time, actually since they started, and we've utilized this and it's a great way to not have to deal with inventory and you know customer issues. And you can do it really quick because they handle all that. 
and I am elated that you are just basically paying creators, uh, at least for a year, a buck for every product that's sold. That's a pretty big deal. Now with all the kudos and pats on the back, YouTube, here's the thing for my suggestions. Now, I hope the product team's listening and here are some suggestions you probably thought of, but you haven't necessarily instituted because you wanted to get it out a little bit quicker. First off, please give the creators the ability to turn on the merchandise shelf for selected videos. Now, I want it to be on all videos if the creator wants to, or you can go into the monetization section and just do click a checkbox saying, hey, I want my merchandise shelf to show up. That would be really cool. And number two, please give YouTube creators the ability to sort their products on the shelf. And let me tell you why. There are content creators that'll probably have 30, 40 different products, and maybe their best selling product should be at the beginning or they need to be sorted in a certain order, let's give that power to the creator. Now, this might be a Teespring thing, but you guys are partners now. <laughs> so figure it out. It's super easy. Let's make this happen. But serious YouTube, I think this is a great, great addition uh, to the platform. And I think it's a very powerful way to make more money here on YouTube. Now, those people that are listening to this video, what is your thoughts of the new YouTube merch shelf? Is it a win? Is it a bust? Do you agree with me? Do you disagree with me? Put it in the comments below. Let's have an active discussion because that's what we do here on YouTube. We discuss things about YouTube for YouTube, for strategy, for your YouTube success. So don't forget to put your comments in there, hit that subscribe button and the bell notification so you don't miss out and watch another video about whatever popped up. <laughs>